Hey guys, Rhino Bones here with my last wish video. I got my final item in the mail today, and I'm going to open them up and let's find out what they are. Obviously, because they're my items and they're the last ones I was waiting on, I know what they are. But I'll be interested to see what they look like in person. This one took a long time trying to get out of customs. And I assume it's because of what it is. They probably tossed it through an x-ray machine a couple of times. I don't know. Maybe I'm giving the company that made this thing too much credit for realism. But it's supposed to be something nifty that goes with along, along with one of my old themes. Yep, 45 centimeters. This is the one. Come on. Let's see what we got. Last but not least, let's open her up. Sounds like it's in a lot of pieces. Wow. Some very yellow tape. Very crushed packing. Yeah, let's see here. We've got plastic base. I don't know if you can see it, but I sure can. It looks purple. Hopefully that's not indicative of what the rest of it is. It's very thick, though. We've got a... Let's see, I will assume this will go down at the bottom, underneath. Like so. Yep, looks like it. I'll go ahead and twist this thing on. So yeah, there we go. My, my first item for the day. A stand. Isn't that awesome? I'm kidding. There's obviously more to it than this. All right. Preparation complete. Ooh, handsome. This is a skeleton meant for classroom use. Got nice of nice little bits of excess plastic on it. The joints all seem to be functioning okay. Hey, they can even be tightened up. That's cool. Don't want to lose those screws. So I'll tighten them up a little bit. Let's see here. Leg bones connected to the thigh bone. Oh man. That Oh, <laughs> that smells so bad. That smells like a... It smells like a beefy fart. That's what that smells like. Wow. I, I can't imagine. Oh, man. Here, take a whiff. Sniff that guy. Yeah, that is a... Uh, that's a... That's a rank, rank stink. Goodness. I, I've never smelled something that smelled like that coming out of a package before. Unless it was a package of farts. Alright. I gotta get my fat fingers stuffed in here to try to stick this together. I'm gonna push pause and be right back. And there we have it. The completed Mr. Skelebone. I will have to come up with some sort of interesting name to give this guy. Probably gonna take it to my classroom stick it on a shelf. I'm not sure. I might stick it on a shelf here in my office. But yeah, I mean, everything looks really cool except for this wonky skull. I mean, that skull right there, that is a skull only a mother could love. And I am not a mother. I'm a grown man that collects toys. And I don't like that head. For one thing, I think it's the jawline here. It's just like way too thick. That is a very wide jawline. God, there was a bad guy on some show a long time ago. He, he always played a bad guy back in the 80s. And he had a chin just like that. I'm not sure what his name was. I'll have to uh, insert a picture of him right here if I can find one. And if I couldn't find one, then I'm just pointing right here for no reason whatsoever. So, yeah, as you can see, he's finished and he's got a nice booty hole that I can stick this metal pipe in. Makes him stand up and shout. So let's scoot it down here. 
There he is, standing up on his little spike. I've got a giant chin. Look at that. He's a cutie, isn't he? All right, so that's cool. I'll be happy to put that up in my classroom. Exactly what I wanted it for. My last item. Hopefully I don't cut the actual product. Is a hat. Because I like wearing hats. Something that uh, bald people tend to do. So I found a style of hat that I like. I thought to myself, hey, I like it. So then I bought it. There's another item that was lost in customs forever. And even though it's one size fits all, and even though they had real pictures of seemingly normal sized adults wearing this, I bet this is like a child's hat. I don't think even undoing these things is going to do me very much good. But it's worth a try. Let me loosen these bad boys up. At least that's easy enough to do. I like the color. It's pretty much like every pair of jeans I own. So that'll be good. I'll be matching and stylish, just like I was back in my denim days. Because we all had denim days, don't deny it. If you deny it, you're a liar. If you don't deny it, then kudos to you. All right, I'm going to try it on. Oh, yeah. You're just going to have to trust me on this. I look fab. I... I'm a fantastic man wearing this hat. Yep. Maybe I'll throw in a picture of it. Anywho, there we go. Those are my two items. Got Mr. Skellibone here. Got my jean hat here, and that was a loud crash. I apologize to anybody listening on their headphones. Actually, I don't, because, gosh, there's like five people who are going to see this. So, hey, those of you listening on your headphones, rewind and play it back for yourself. In the meantime, hopefully I get some more junk in the mail. Uh, I don't have any planned at the moment, but once I do, I will be certain to toss them on my desk here and talk about them lovingly, even if I don't love them. Well, that's about it. Have a good night. See you next time. Bye-bye. Adios. Sayonara.